Hi, I'm Fate Touched, and this is me playing games. And we are back to Haunted Hotel Phoenix, which is the number nine Haunted Hotel, as you can see from the stylized title. And she is Odd Punk. And last time we played this game, we were very confused about everything that was going on, but got even more confused when our old friend James showed up. <gasps> And, and Aunt Punk got very upset. <laughs> and it was kind of worth it for that because it was amazing. And now we're going back. And I guess like there's a mountain hotel that used to be a college. And there's a dude who might be a ghost that sets fires and a scientist we're trying to help. But the girl was bad guy. That was an alternate ending. At any rate, uh, I'm, I'm not sure where we left off exactly, but it was very complicated. So let's figure out where we are. Oh, right, we're frozen or something. And I have a vacuum flask and a metal plate and some stained glass pieces. And in this one, I do not have like a journal or anything. I need to warm up. I know I need to warm up. I'm working on that. That's where I came in from. Oh, that's right. I fell in the river instead of getting burned to death or attacked by the bad guys. And now I'm freezing to death and it's not giving me a lot more help than that. So I need to warm up. Every time I click on something incorrect, that's all it's giving me for information. All right. That looks warm, whatever that is. I... Think that I stopped playing because I couldn't actually figure out what was going on. So let's do a hint. Vacuum is empty, but I can make tea and get warm. It's not empty, it has tea in it! Yes, it is your dad's thermos. Hey, it's just me, James. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you're safe and sound. Callahan used that poisonous gas to escape. Oh, that's right. It was poisonous gas, not fire. I searched the adjoining rooms, and Amanda disappeared. She could be anywhere. I also found something curious. Here, take a look. <laughs> you're not wrong, Erdice. You're not wrong. <laughs> Our investigation must go on. Steven is still in danger. We've got to find where the Duke is keeping him. Okay. Steven is the professor guy who came up with some kind of invention or potion or something. And the Duke is the bad guy from this game and the last game. <laughs> Garfield makes a more realistic detective. All right. Yeah, I, I got that. I mean, can't we just go out the way he went in? It's locked. <laughs> I don't know, is the internet ready for that? I can cut the cloth. And that's a file. Okay. Why do I want to cut the cloth? Ooh, can I... Is this a thing? Yeah. Let's roast James. Guys, you're so mean. All right, got glue and a ladle. These are very weird objects. And what is wrong with this? Oh, now I can pick that up. Figurine part. Can I just... Broken figurine is a prototype of the costume used by the hooded man. Okay. That's for there. It's just a fan it's to dry off whatever's going. Is he just wandering around? Yes. The answer is yes. Oh, there's the bottom. One of the levers is missing. I'm positive that would work. Am I only allowed to put things in in order now? Huh, that's a new mechanic. Usually you can put all the stuff you need in the item part 
and then it will only let you use them once you have all the pieces you need. James, stop moving around. It's freaking me out. A razor blade, which I assume I'm going to cut this with, but I don't know why. What is this nonsense? Why would you do that? Why would you hide an adjustable wrench behind a wing from a box suspended on the ceiling? How does that make any sense? No, I just like he's teleporting and it's bizarre. What is that? It's covered in lime. It can be removed, but I need something tough. Ooh, little lead soldiers. Tin soldiers. They're probably lead. Ah. Uh, Metal plate? No, I don't know what that, that's for. I assume these guys go over here and then you melt them. But we have to melt them somewhere. It's locked. There must be a button somewhere that opens it. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, I can go back now. Oh, that makes my life ever so much easier. So then we melt the tin soldiers. I don't think that would get hot enough. It might get hot enough to melt tin. It certainly wouldn't get hot enough to melt most things. Oh, I hate this game. Why are they leading into this one? Pinecone soldier. Knife. Coin. Who's that? Who's this? Coin. Who's that? Such a lazy way to do find it puzzles. Maybe a watch. Oh, not a great watch. Attack a pinecone soldier. Oh, it's a light bulb. That's a pillar. The other part's here. Here's a pinecone. No idea. There. All right, we're going to move. Let's attack. I don't think that's a thing can't move that. I got some light bulb and the wood part. Oh, he's attacked. All right, I'm missing here. I have a light bulb. I haven't seen light bulb. There's nothing to lose. Oh, there it is. All right, is there anything else I need in here? Can I go back further? No, okay. That's fine. So let's pour. <laughs> That's a terrible idea. I think that would take considerably longer than that, but at least they're trying to make it work like normal people. I just put both of those things back- well, I put one of the things back in, because it needs two to open, and then I only used one to open it. Oh no, it's the bad guy who's been standing there for the whole time. Okay. Just let him close the door, guys. He escaped again. Because you're not, like, doing anything! You totally could have run that far! Ah, uh, he got away again. And he blocked off the door. <sighs> well, we'll just have to raise the gates manually. But we'll need the key. Why did somebody put a picture of the button there? Thanks for the input, James. You need to find something to pull down that cord. That's the only thing over there, okay. Uh, a lamp, and a whatever that is, and a hook. Metal rod is about to fall off. If only I had a file that I had in the last room. And a rake. And a flooded basement. Oh, there's no kerosene. Okay. It's fine. It's all rusty. It was. It was a different time all of ten minutes ago. No, okay, that's just the front of the car. And that's still just the front of the car. Right. Oh, can I use the rake to get that down? Good. Okay, now I have the button. And now we have doors that need pieces. It's a lot of that in the Haunted Hotel games. It's not even just like special things, they're just like shapes. What is that? This printed mechanism looks promising, but not without a switch. But what is it? Is it like a hole punch machine? Yeah, I know, me too. What can I use to cut this? Any number of things that you won't actually let me use. Like this rake would probably cut through it. No, huh? Thank you. 
Oh, that's kerosene. I thought it was solvent. My bad. I mean, there's people that live here, so it might not be that old. It totally depends on who the truck belongs to, I guess. Maybe. Maybe he likes tea with lemon. I don't know. Pump. In case of flood, pump out water in steam shop. Look, we used a tool twice. It's a miracle. And my rake is gone. What is that? It's a triangle amulet. Look, a specific lemon juicer. In case you want to specifically juice lemons. <laughs> what am I doing? Can I use the chisel to open this? Of course not. Yep, yep. Can I use the chisel on this? Nope. Right, so now what? We finished with that. That's the way out. Oh, I can use the chisel on this. This place is very weird. So this is the hotel's heating room. I suppose there's an emergency exit to the upper floors. Why do you suppose that? I guess that dummy got the bad end of that saber. Okay. A hanger, and I guess I need another pearl. Weird. There's the washing machine. That's not the right kind of belt, but that's okay. There's a door behind the washing machine, but I can't move the machine without the missing wheel. That's another thing Haunted Hotel does a lot. Oh, okay. So we need a belt. Insert plug to start pump. This pump station will help to pump the water out of the garage cell. All I need to do is activate the switch. And the switch is missing. Why wouldn't you have like a sign, this is for the basement? Why do you have to take a picture and then circle the thing? It's a ducky. I'll get scalded if I grab the duck. What could I use? Like a rake, for example. Also, why is there a vat of hot water over here? Uh, that was weird. Why do we have a rubber ducky with a hook in the head? Why do we need a rubber duck? Wait, what else is here? Something else is here. Aha! I should touch a defective cable. Oh, I shouldn't touch a defective cable with bare hands. What on earth is this? Why did it have a giant metal bolts in the side of it? And that turned into a rubber glove? No, it did not! I'll show. I should have done that before I plugged it in, but that's fine. Okay, I'm going to read the directions this time. I don't know. Rotate the wires to connect them with each other and start up the pump. Okay. I, I had a game like this. Uh, I want to say it was maybe two games ago. Maybe it was a longer than that. And... I was trying to connect them all together, and really I was supposed to be making it so they weren't touching. <laughs> Which made the puzzle a lot harder to figure out. Also, this is way easier than I thought it was going to be. In the... Was that English? You have any keys? No, I don't have any keys anymore. Dad has all the keys forever. Ta-da! You're wrong! You're lying! I am not lying! Dad has the big red thing with the keys on it. Go away. Love my children. Love my children. Even when they're very loud. Yeah, I, I know. We literally just did that. Whoa, what is this nonsense? It's a moth. This is a very strange angle. 
Okay. Uh, sure. So we need a ribbon. Oh, no, that's a belt. What is that? I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is either. Some sort of plant or feather? Oh, it's a plant. There's a rose. And a hat. And a paper boat. And one of those. Tennis racket? Yep. And that kind of looks like a fleur-de-lis, sort of. Ah, it's a leaf. Yep. More hats. Gotta be fancy with hats, you know. A grandfather clock. And a hubcap ball and I clicked on the moth now what is this it's not the emperor is that the boot yep thank you odd he's literally doing nothing yes you're helping James is not he's just staring at stuff and not actually doing anything A sweaty, or a sweaty, a hoodie. A sweatshirt is what I was trying to say. Duke, you was always loyal to me, but I can't do it. Steven is a fair man. He doesn't deserve death. That's one of the pearls. What else? Oh. That's it? That's all I need here? Okay. You was always loyal to me. Yeah, apparently. That looks like King Tut's beard. I always wanted to try on a hockey mask, but it's not the right moment now. I need to even the scales. Can't I take any of the cool things that are in here? No? Now I have a saber! Why do I need a saber? I don't know. I think we're finally done in here. What else needs to be done in here? Oh, we can use the saber to open the bag of lemons. Now it's gonna... Really? You, you made that a puzzle game? Really? Collect four lemons. <laughs> like, I can see if they, like, rolled under the car or something. Oh, gotta put the lid back on. Don't want to make a mess. Also, I think you need to peel them first or something? Citric acid. I mean, it's lemon juice. Which has citric acid in it. Keys and a wheel for some reason. I need the correct code. Okay, where that's the washing machine needs the wheel. Looks like this door leads to one of the hotel rooms. However, it can't be opened without a key. And that's the key for the truck, not the key for that. Wait, how do I use the key for the truck? Oh. Hey! How come you get to drive the truck? And how come- Oh! They moved it now, but the truck was attached to the pulley which lifted the door. It's a very strange way to do things, but okay. He's still walking- Why you give up? How slow is this dude? That is a very pretty bird. He escaped on the elevator. I need to catch him. Okay. Why is there a hot dog bun thing here that actually has hot hot dogs? I need something to block the steam. Why? Oh. <laughs> yes, Erdite, you are correct. Since I can't bribe it, I need to find a way to scare the bird off. Yell and scream at it and run with your arms flailing. There we go. Yeah, I hear you, cranky bird. 
branches prevent me from getting through. Okay. I don't get why there's a hot dog stand there. Is that a crossbow? A harpoon! A harpoon is even better! <laughs> and look, another file! This is the second file we've had. Why couldn't I have just kept the first one? Growl. I'm not gonna harpoon the bird, am I? Scare away the bird with a harpoon. How? We have a harpoon gun. And this is a file. We're missing a button for that. We need a hexagon. Oh, we can use this here. And we now have hexagon. <laughs> yeah, the Kikachu. That's right. Kikachus are afraid of hawks. <laughs> they never point out why. <laughs> This bolt would be perfect, but I can't reach it. And there's a switch. This game is confusing me. Like, more so than normal. Did that just print us the code for this? Do they have that whole machine there so it can print the code for that thing? Okay. Two, star, four, eight, question mark? All right, two, star, four, seven. Two, star, four, nine. Two, star, four, five. Two, star, four, six. Two, star, four, five. Two, star, four, six. Two, star, four, three. Two, star, four, count. Two, star, four, zero. Jerk. All right, that's the key to the door behind the washing machine. Which leads... It looks like the hooded man used to live here. I need to investigate. It looks like he still lives here. And he's a messy boy. Looks like a cipher sheet. If I apply the right piece of paper over it, I'll need to get a... I'll get the needed set of symbols. Alright, and I don't want any of this other stuff. Why does he have like a pretend person up here reading a book? <laughs> this is very weird. Yeah, that could be. I need one of those. This thing clearly takes a cipher. Yeah. Okay. That's all you're gonna give me, huh? Yep. I didn't notice. Now what? Duke Callahan was confident that Stephen could unlock the secrets of that gas, and he was right. Stephen's discovery was groundbreaking. Stephen noted that when the substance changes from a liquid to a gas, it releases chemicals that restore human cells. Is this the key to immortality? But this gas had a side effect. Severe hallucinations. Callahan knew he could use this to his advantage. Okay. Apparently it's only with Steven's help that Duke could su succeed in researching the gas. Amanda was just a puppet in his hands. I need to save Steven trapped up there on the mountaintop. Yeah, that is a thing apparently. Oh, I want to open this. That's what I was doing. Oh, poop. Okay, there we go. That's dumb. Why bother with this part? Why not just line that up? That 
That's clear glass. How is there something behind it? 1978. Uh, let's see. Here's the one. There's one, nine, seven, eight. It's all the same symbols on the sofa. All right, so I need a double safer. It was. It very was. All years are weird years in their own special way. This is a lot of random stuff that makes me very uncomfortable for this dude. All right, so we have beads. We have a razor. Three feathers. One, two, three. Not quite as bad as the gun room in the... Was that the first haunted hotel or the second haunted hotel? Well, yeah, they're not going to let me solve this with a gun. That's not a thing. Yeah, where's James? Three matches. I thought that said machetes, but nope, matches. I don't know where James is. <laughs> he probably got caught by the bad guy or something. Or eaten by the eagle. Magnets. Measuring tape, handcuffs, but I guess I need the key, or a pin, a radio, which I totally saw, and now I don't. Is that it? No. A speaker, which I did not totally saw, and an eagle photo, which that is the other half of. I need tape. Well, I mean, technically. All right, so we need a radio, a speaker, and some tape move so i can look up here move or you know just stay there for oh i have to click okay why am i not seeing either of these things am i missing something she was eaten by a crew there's an old uh reference oh there's the radio i was looking for like a radio radio they don't mean this for the speaker no i don't think so Oh, it's not a speaker, it's a megaphone! Stupid game. Where's the tape? No. Thank you, Ah. Uh... Yay, I got a magnet. Why do I need a magnet? I don't know why I need a magnet. Nope, not gonna let me take a gun. They've only let me do that when I shoot ghosts. I'm not allowed to shoot people. Only ghosts. Why do I need a magnet? Do I have a map? Yes, I do have a map. Yay. All right, there's the player. No current task. <laughs> okay, current task. Yeah, they, you're not giving me any help here, game. No current, oh, there they are. Wow, those are hard to see. Okay, so that means I need to combine something. If I attached a magnet to it, I could retrieve the metal items. Yeah. I don't like that. That is 100% to think that would work, but the magnet's supposed to stick out the other direction. I don't like that at all. Pop Punk always likes to shoot things because sometimes that's the best action. This is the weirdest thing I've ever seen. And we're going to shoot the bird now, huh? Are we going to shoot the ice and drop it on his head? That could also kill him, you know. Okay, well, that's good. Nope, that's exactly what we're going to do. <sighs> that could have killed the bird. That's all I'm saying. Special card. I guess I can't go that way. Or harpoon them, yeah. I uh, need to be over here. Yes. Okay. We got the last cipher. Which is E. Upside down Y. Tree. And long N. And that is what? Oh, that's the elevator card. Okay. 
<laughs> oh, I went the wrong way. Those are Greek letters, aren't they runes? I might be completely wrong, because I don't know all the Greek letters. Okay. Ot Punk would know. Here I am at the top of the mountain. This is the moment of truth. It is? You think you can just walk up to me? You think you'll save Steven so easily? <laughs> oh no, you broke the bridge. If only I had a gun. I should find a way to rescue Steven. No, duh. You're just gonna stand there too, huh, James? You guys are so useless. I can't take it out. Maybe a shovel can help. I know you have robots, yes. And there's his gas mask. Oh, he put it down. Oh, look, it's it it's a Sherlock hat. Why am I finding stars? Why? Oh. Oh. <sighs> this is literal busy work. This is not a test of skill or anything like that. This is just can you figure out which order things go in? So lazy. Is there anything sharp around here? Yeah, but they probably won't let me use any of them. And now I have a stick. Do I need anything else here? You would think maybe. Is it? I think I need this. Yeah. Get us a pizza. And I need something sharp for that. A beaver! He looks so puzzled. He might have lost his friend. Okay. Sure. Oh, there's the other one. I guess he's stuck over there. And... I can shoot the gas bottles to neutralize them. I mean, yeah. I guess. And I have a stick. Oh, I'm gonna put the freaking thing on the stick. And I don't need to... If only we had a gun. Am I gonna get the beaver over here? I guess? No? Wait, what do you want? If you could find me a boat hook, I can save that beaver. Yeah, that's our high priority right now. What? <laughs> you, you did it. You saved the beaver. What? What? And now they're friends. And they're gonna eat this tree. And they're friends. And I have a stick. And now I have two sticks. And now I have three sticks. Okay. Um. Oh, and four, and I have to get all the way over here! And now I have a pile of sticks. Those are not wood blocks, they're branches! I think it's gonna be a board, but yeah. And like the dude is just standing there, so like why is he watching us do this instead of like running away or... What? Let's assemble a wooden platform so we can reach Callahan. Why are you being so unhelpful? Why don't you do it? Just try and stop me. If you survive my gas! The gas is dispersing. Quick, find a gas mask. Try this! Where am I gonna find a gas mask? How did he- I thought- Oh, that wasn't his gas mask. I'm gonna make a gas mask from stuff that's just laying around. 
and expect it to work. And now I have rocks. And a knife. I don't understand all of this. And now he's just gonna stand there staring at him while we're doing something else. And the beavers are fine inhaling all this gas, apparently. Or they're not, and they're having weird dreams and they just don't know about it. Callahan is the Duke, the bad guy. Gotcha. 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 What did- What just happened? Maybe I'm wrong, I don't know. Here, I found these keys on Callahan while I was searching him. Why don't you search his tent? We've got to find some handcuffs and anything that can help us save Steven. Uh, I don't understand what's going on. All right, we have to play the two or the one. Wait. Yeah, OK, good job, me. Find the matching keys. I am not doing very good at this. There we go. Handcuffs. He had handcuffs in his tent for some reason. Now can't I just take this board and run it across there? Well, I guess I'm using the ladder. Alright, that seems less safe. Oh, even if it's an extension ladder. That seems even less safe. Oh, okay, I have to have them in the specific spots. That's fine. Yay! Oh no, it's the bad lady! Oh, Steven, you're alive! There's so much I need to say! I was working for Duke Callahan, but he okay. used both of us. How can I trust you after what you did to me? I never wanted you to die. I didn't know he would go Where'd that far. Where'd he get far. a key? I was trying to change everything. You should have stayed dead! No! Ugh. Oh no! You'll pay for what you've done. I'm not letting you escape. No! Amanda, don't die. Please, don't leave me. It's okay, Stephen. I'm glad I could finally protect you. I'm so sorry. The end. <laughs> it's a big... Okay, so that was Duke Callahan. I was right. I guess he goes over the waterfall and dies, or he stays alive and is a continuing villain, which I'm not particularly looking forward to. I guess the lady dies and they save the good guy and James doesn't do anything useful again. And the end. <laughs> These games end so abruptly. Oh my gosh. And yeah, no moral, I guess, except don't trust people. James is not a good detective or good at watching the bad guys when they're tied up. He was totally supposed to watch that crazy lady in, in the, not the last game, the one before that. And they had him, or he decided to leave the lady alone and she got loose and burned the whole house down. <laughs> so, it's not. Go do this for me, go do that for me, go do it yourself. Why do I have to do it? Oh my goodness. Um, so that's the main game. Just under an hour for that. So I guess we can play the uh, extra bonus chapter next when the credits are done because lots of people put lots of work into this so we can watch the credits, it won't kill us. Oh, sorry, I was yawning, I'm tired. No, he didn't. He died in the alternate ending. 
Of course, that was taking place way before this. And the original games were taking place like ye olden England days. So I have no idea how he's still alive in a game that's taking place in current time. I assume lots of retconning. He did get a haircut. Uh, same voice actor though. The voice actor's not bad. It's just his character is like so not good at doing anything useful. He never finds it. Well, sometimes he finds like one thing. He never helps with anything. He's let two bad guys go now, and one of them died in a fire, and one of them killed a person, so good job with that. Let's see. Anything good over here? And there was no ghost in this, by the way. That, yeah, not, not a haunted hotel. There was a weird dude who was creepy. Not, yeah, he, his hat, like, is too big on him and too small at the same time or something. But yeah, uh, no, that, that didn't work out well. No, no haunting this time. It wasn't, it was very, like, convoluted how the rooms and stuff were put together, too. There's the music, and a screensaver. This image is really cool. Probably. Why wouldn't- cause, cause I told you, he has the generic sexy dude voice. We did not get all of the achievements. Never do. Figurine collection. Wow, what is all this? This firebird is believed to live in the far north. It's said that if you see it flying, luck be with you, but if the bird sees you, then bad luck will follow all the rest of your life. That's a cat. That's not a bird. The Al- Wow. Alkonost is a legendary bird from Russia with a beautiful woman's head. It entrances people with its irresistible song. Those who listen become obsessed, forgetting everything else. That's cool. Fire peafowl as symbols of prosperity were targets of treasure hunters since the time immemorial. It was believed that if someone saw the fire peafowl, riches would follow them for the rest of their life. In Russian folklore, the Gamyan is a prophetic bird with the head of a woman that doesn't have the head of a woman. It lives near paradise and is associated with deep wisdom and endless knowledge. Chinese dragons are snake-like reptiles that can take on many animal forms. Legends say these massive beasts caused many natural disasters, but they are also symbols of power and good luck. And generally, they don't have those wings. They generally don't have any wings. Or they have really tiny ones. That's a griffin. Griffins are creatures with a lion's body and four paws, back paws. This one has front paws. Wings and the head of an eagle. Once hailed as kings of all creatures, legends say they guard priceless treasures. Pegasus is a winged divine stallion symbolizing heroism, wisdom, and purity as symbolized by its white color. What are you? In Slavic legends, the fire bird is a magical creature that glows like fire. A single feather can light an entire room, and seeing one foretells either doom or blessing. Cool. I wonder if we'll find the rest of them. I wish they told me what that is, because that is definitely a cat of some sort. What is this? Oh, these were the puzzle pieces I was supposed to collect. I guess I didn't find them all. And then we can play, what's the secret? Oh, we have to finish the bonus chapter. The secret room is usually something dumb. Bonus chapter, here we go. <laughs> no, just have winged animals. I mean, Pegasus isn't even a monster. It's just a winged horse. Detective? Detective, I'm sorry to interrupt, but you're needed at Stone Spires. We've discovered something important during our investigation. Please, come with me. It looks like I'm not done with Stone Spires. It seems Duke left even more secrets to discover. 
Good to see you again. Excellent work on that Callahan case, Detective. As I said, we've discovered something in Callahan's office. Come see for yourself. This way, please. Okay. Oh, this leads right into here. Duke's office. What have the police discovered? I'll let you take a look around first. Why don't you tell me what you found first? We've preserved the office just as Callahan left it. Maybe you'll find something we missed. You just said you discovered something! We'd really appreciate your help with this investigation. Thank you. So, there are clues. I better expl- You just told me you found something! What was it? <sighs> Sigh. His office was there the whole time we found his office. And they said they found something in his office. They are liars. Or they're being very obtuse, one or the other. Either way, it's very irritating. I mean, it would be a lot nicer if they would just tell us what they found instead of making us look around. What is that a picture of? Oh, it's a book. Perhaps this will come in handy. What does it say? Phobos Project. Apparently Duke Callahan collected the results of some experiments. How are the birds connected to this? Did he want to crossbreed the species to create something totally new and disturbing? Oh, that's an eagle. That's a vulture and that's a woodpecker. Wait, go back. Oh no. Okay, sorry. I just flipped through the whole book and didn't read any of it. So let me read this now because I just skipped through everything. Breeding of animals. A unique hybrid is obtained. It's not just a bird. It's the king of the sky. That's pretty cool. Beyond birds. Duke was also interested in sea creatures. It looks like this page describes the experiment of crossbreeding a turtle and a piranha. <laughs> Boy, I'm sorry this dream missed us originally. <laughs> That's definitely a thing someone wrote. Select armor and longevity of turtles, teeth and eyesight of piranhas. Hybrid became extremely tenacious and dangerous. It doesn't have any rivals in the water. Do piranhas have good eyesight? I actually don't know that. Okay, next bit. The information on these pages is more interesting. He was about to crossbreed apes with other animals and create something new. He obviously wanted to use a human as the base for this nefarious plan. This is starting to sound like the void from Mystery Trackers, which was very weird. Okay, let's see. Experiment with mammals. We bred primates. The obtained hybrid somewhat similar to people. And who will we obtain if we add human to the variable? King of beasts. That sounds like a terrible plan. Okay, back to our regularly scheduled stream. I, I didn't know it was going to do that. Sorry. Maybe? All right. So you're going to tell me what you found? No, he's not going to tell me anything. The Duke was on the wanted list for years. I wonder how many crimes he committed. Gunpowder. Hey, that bird thing is gone. Hmm, Duke secured it with a coded lock. Yeah, you just have to rearrange the pictures. I could have figured that out without that. Thank you. A new ring that goes on the box. Money! And a wrench. Okay, do I need to keep doing everything in this room or can I go somewhere else? Okay. 
Looks like the police have expanded their investigation to include the ruined campus. How many something or other? Why didn't I notice this passage before? Duke seems to have deliberately hidden it. Very suspicious. He hid everything. Why is that suspicious? Yeah, I know. It wouldn't be cool if there was like a, a neato like secret lock place that like created them all like one company. I don't know. That. What is this? Coal. Like charcoal? Okay. Part of the gate's caved in and stuck to the frozen ground. I need a shovel. If it's frozen, you out of luck, kid. Frozen ground is like concrete. It's a bird. What is this chick doing here? It must be scared. Oh no, birdie. I save you. Probably. I don't know. I could. Is it like chugging or something? Like, why is it like stuttering? Why is it doing that? Bolt is too tight. Why do I need. Sorry about the chugging, everyone. I don't know why it's doing that. Oh. I guess? Either that or everyone else in my house is using all of the internet. Is it fishy? <laughs> Wouldn't that be sad? Alright, that's not helpful. I can always break this inelegant but effective. Yeah, whenever I want to do that, you guys get mad at me. No, you're not allowed to do that. Uh, yeah, I know. I mean, they might not be, but... Okay, I can't go backwards. I have wire... Well, let me put the fishy away. I know where the fishy goes. Fishy go here. Now I just need a bird. Oh, maybe it is. Okay, I have wire, and charcoal, and a wrench, and gunpowder. And... Wow, now it's really chunking hard. It says my encoder FPS didn't like that. And my KBPS upload is... Well, it was slow. So I don't know what any of that means. But if anyone else does, then you could let me know. Dropping frames. Well, it kind of is. <laughs> Computer can't handle Okay, that's a book. These doors are wedged shut and the hinges look broken. Wrench! Oh, uh, what is this? Ah, we're making a hook. Want to get this? Okay, good, because you aren't getting that open. I'm telling you. OBS? What does that mean? have to use real words, people. I'm using Twitch's streaming platform. Uh, Twitch Studio. There's the mommy bird! Oh no, that's another one. That's very weird, Aught. Thank you. Oh no, bees! Clay gunpowder? No, okay. <laughs> and the football. What is that? I'm sure I have the right tool somewhere. Why do I want to take the seat off? I've never had a problem with it before, though, which is weird. Can I smush that in there? I don't know why I want to do that. I should heat dry the clay. Okay. Huh. Ew. That's weird. First of all, that's made of metal and wouldn't be floating. Second of all, it's winter. This should be frozen over. And if it's not, that fish isn't just gonna sit there. That's silly business. Ah. 
Okay, now I have a flamethrower. That's actually a specific type of thing you use to clear ice and snow where it's really cold. We all floated the green. You used that joke once before. <laughs> That's just a bunch of nonsense. Th First of all, why is nothing happening? Oh. Well, it really doesn't like this. All right, we're gonna skip that because that's stupid. Boulders don't roll around like that. Looks like Duke was working on something significant. What is inside this reserve? There's another baby chick. Oh no, we have to save them. I don't know. The lever lever's broken. Okay, so we need to find broken levers. Here's the other half of the pruner. The gates are closed. Big eagles. It's pretty cool. <laughs> That's different. Okay. Um, how do I get it off? Okay. What? Nothing will work without the right formation. I can't move the letters though. Levers, not letters. What is- Oh, that's the card for the thing in front of the- Whatever this is. Book drop, maybe? I guess it was a school. It might have been a library. A book. Can I use- No, I can't use that. Red list. Weather back. Weather back. It's a leather back sea turtle, not a weather back sea turtle. Leather back sea turtle. Western lowland gorilla. Northern sportive lemur. Ivory billed woodpecker. Weather back. Okay, so that one needs to go up. That one's down. That one's up. Hang on. Let, let me try this again. Okay. Okay. Nope. It's just in the wrong order. I'm bringing weather back? Really? Oh, we are not playing this game again. Everyone saw how terrible I was at it the last time I tried it. We good. I, my dyslexia does not know left-right very well. And it's locked with a key, of course. All right, let's go kill the bees or the wasps. I guess they're not bees. Those look like paper wasps or mud wasps. I can't quite tell. Either way, they need to go find someplace else. I should carefully move the chair to reach the racket. A string would come in as a string. Okay. Another <laughs> dead wasps. A screwdriver! Wait, that's not where I needed that. Where did I need that? I was staring at it just now. Wasn't I? Why the heck did I need a screwdriver? Yeah, you're a grumpy fish. I remember that. I'm not crazy. I know I needed a screwdriver. Player. There it is. I wasn't just looking at it, but I did remember needing it. And there's a random switch in there for no reason. Wait, do I need something else here? It's always helpful to know where to get some water. Okay. Now I forget where I needed this switch. This place. Bizarre. Why would this be under the bleachers? Uncover six pairs. Oh my gosh, I hate this game. 
I would much rather play like a normal hidden object game. Alright, those are ice skates. There's the boot. Is this to hit the fish with? That would be amusing. No, guess not. Now I have a shoelace. Hit the fish. <laughs> Why is that helpful? I could pull it out all by myself! I could hit the fish with the racket. No, huh? I suppose it's not nice to hit fish. <laughs> do we have fast travel in this? I didn't even pay attention. We do! About time I noticed that, huh? Though I guess in the original game, we didn't go back to many rooms. We were usually stuck in like three rooms. To reserve. So this is where Duke performed all his experiments. Looks like each door leads to a separate place for animals, birds, or sea creatures. Really, each door leads to a separate place. I never would have expected that. Hey, that's the ghost TV guy from the last game. Is that another chick or is that the mama one? It won't let me click on it. Hello, detective. Please excuse my appearance. Okay. I'm one of Tim Callahan's victims. I'd agreed to participate in Project Eternity, but when it failed, they wouldn't let me leave. You're a TV ghost. Stone Spires National Park contains many rare animals. Animals that Callahan cruelly experimented on. Many of them are critically endangered. Please, you must save them before they become extinct. Perhaps while you're helping them, you can find a way to free me. Okay, Mr. TV Ghost. It needs a key card. What's this? A box of matches with... What? Why would you do that? Why would you light the match if you don't need it yet? Come in. What you need, bug? All right, let's see. Depress all the tumblers to break open the lock. Start at the end and work backwards, noting that not all the lights on a tumbler may need to be lit. I don't know what that means. Yep, nope, not doing that. That is literally just another one I'm guessing games. You guys have fun. I'm going to keep playing over here. I can't believe it. It's so incredible in here. I should look around and make sure all the sea creatures are okay. Well, they're not in the sea, so they can't be that okay. Part of the code is missing. I can saw this part of the table. It looks like someone, some things were stashed underneath. Why would, Never mind. Oh my gosh. All right, let's use our already lit match that totally hasn't gone out yet. Oh, I guess I don't get to pick it up. We need a special key to get the water flowing, I guess. Look, a piranha. There's always piranha. And a ladder. What happened to that tennis racket? Why can't I use that, huh? I need to distract this. Oh. We don't have any fishing line. Good. How can I reach the other side of the room? I can't left. There's a bridge! Um, ladder? It's a leatherback sea turtle! Oh no, he doesn't have any water. Okay. No, I do not mean weatherback. Also, leatherback sea turtles are gigantic. They're so big. What is that? Oh, it's a lure. And I need a saw to saw into the table for some reason. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
No, I don't want to go there. Okay, and this needs a key card. I don't know. I don't know a lot of things about this, but that is one of the things I don't know. Did I ever find something that was saw-like? No, not really. Uh, da, 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 da. Where do I need to be? I need to be in here. Really? Alright, I need a key for this. I need a saw for this. And a code for this. I think I could figure that code out without finding the other half of the actual code. There's a gigantic leatherback sea turtle, which is not... I don't know how we got that up there either. Those are gigantic. I don't have any... What am I supposed to be doing in here? Yeah, I'd love to get that, but I don't have any string on my fishing pole. Yeah, I know, you want to eat my fingers. I understand. You're a fish, it's what you do. What? Does anybody else understand what's going on here? That's not how fishing lures work. And that was just to get string. What is that? Ah, a thing with lots of pockets. And a triangle. Okay, where's the triangle go? The triangle goes way back here. And there's a saw. And now we go back and saw the table. If they made me do that with that fast travel, I would be angry. One of the last games we played didn't have fast travel, and it was like, nope, this is, this is the worst. This is the worst thing. And it made you walk everywhere, too. Huh, this is interesting. Swap the round sliders by selecting the green buttons between each... between them. Each round slider must end up in a section of matching color. Oh, oh, okay. I didn't really know what they meant by sliders. Over there. Now. Over there. Over there. Got it. And that is filling up the turtle tank. Yay! Leatherback sea turtle. Yeah, no, I, I got... It's not one of the rarest creatures on Earth, but it sure as heck is one of the biggest creatures on Earth. And... Oh, that's part of the lock. I mean, now we can just tell the police that they're here and they can figure out how on earth they're going to get a whale shark down the side of a mountain? What on earth? It's a gorilla. Aw, and lemurs. And a uh, lion? Puma. Which probably would have eaten the gorilla by now. Or vice versa, I guess. Looks like this was locked by a caretaker. It's definitely important. It's probably a tranquilizer gun, but yeah, even still. Oh yeah, no, those are over here. Let's see. Four, two, six, one. Are you really gonna make me write that down? Really? <sighs> that 
that to Puma. Puma is angry. I can remember four numbers. Even me, even me, I can remember four numbers. Four, two, six, one. So dumb. And we got a glass jar. Right. How does that help us? All right. Not loaded. It's probably in the ammunition box, but. Okay, that's. This is the fishes. This is the animals. This must be the birds. But I need something to cut that with. Where does that go? Hmm. I don't remember seeing anything that shape. Undiscovered. Yeah, no, that's a triangle. Oh, why do I need water? Why do I need water? Is this just to pour on the kitty? No, huh? Oh, he needs water in his dish. He could also definitely fit between those bars. And he gave me a nail puller. Claw sharpener might work on a blunt blade. Okay. It won't work there, really? It might. Maybe not. Will that work? Yes. I'm gonna let me use it even though it doesn't have a handle? Heaven forbid I hold it with my hands and it's a little bit uncomfortable. That's illegal. This door will only open with the Duke's fingerprint. Now that's quite a challenge. Yes, it is. Considering he went over the side of a waterfall, supposedly. That's actual shotgun shells. Are we actually going to shoot the puma? There will be no shot without gunpowder. They come pre-packed, guys. We're really gonna use a shotgun on the puma. Oh, just up in the air. Good, that made it angry. Okay. How did that help me? Besides not getting eaten. Oh, okay. There's stuff over here. Oh, cart without a wheel. Who knew? It's a very tiny cave. It is. It's very little. An oven mitt. Okay. A weird thing to need. Wait, no, over here. And then we can go all the way back here and put this in, which is a spreader clamp. Hmm. Oh, that's for this. Where the wheel is for some reason. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> And the policeman's badge. It, this looks like Duke's fingerprint. I need to copy it to get to the aviary. If that's his fingerprint, his hand is as big as my face. Also, how are you supposed to copy it? Oh, you're still standing here like an idiot. A donut! I want a donut. Donuts are so good. All right, let's see. I'm not actually paying attention. Tape player or dictaphone. This is a weird assortment of things. A car. And whatever that is. Tank. And another piece of paper. Rope. Class. Oh, this must be like a fingerprinting kit, I guess? 
don't know what the duct tape is for. I don't think that they generally use duct tape in fingerprinting. Bill folds. No, that's just regular money. Another piece of paper. Huh. And a pipe and a flask and metals. More tape. And a flask. Whatever that is. Oh, that must be like the powder stuff. A grenade. How about this grenade? Tape. Tape should be on a roll of tape, but. Up oh, there's the metals. And more tape. Sure. Alright, now we warp back here and find the giant fingerprint that's the same size as, like, the bottom part of that rib cage. And takes up that entire piece of paper. <laughs> yeah, but this is almost over. Fingerprints? Never mind. We're just gonna go this way. Need a light bulb. What can I use to get closer to this spot? This chick got lost. Oh, there's the mommy. We found her. Ivory build woodpecker. I know, you miss your babies. We'll find them. This is loose. Oh, okay. I thought we needed to take it off. We're going to get the babies. Uh, with oven mitts? No, huh? Okay. Alright. We need to go back over here. Oh, this thing. And now we have a pole. Which we need over here. That is obviously a stick. Not the metal pole that we just got. Ah, that's what this is for. It's easier to use a sock, but that might just be me. What's in here? Aww. It's a magpie. They, if you, if you're, they're your friends, they're very cool, and if they are not your friends, they are very angry birds. They do not like people unless they like you. If that makes any sense. Alright, let's see. Berries. Another lemon! There are a lot of lemons in this game. Pine cone, pine cone, pine cone. Compass. Pills. Three insects. Is a praying mantis, and a, and I clicked off. Gosh darn it! And some sort of stag beetle, and an ant, and then we have a drum, and a shiny box, and a fork, and a statue, and a necklace. Oh, there's the other part, and a zebra, but it's not done yet. He needed his nose. And we found a shiny box. And it contains screws! That sort of makes sense. It even makes sense that a magpie would have it because magpies like shiny things. Oh, this is a bird call to get the babies. Alright, that works. It's a baby! Let's go find them all! I wonder if that's the actual call of that type of woodpecker. They're so cute! I love them! Wait, where were the other ones? Back this way. Yep, there's one. Yay! Save the babies! 
Another one. What was the last one? Oh, it was over on the tennis court. And save the last baby. Aww. Here you go, birdies. Alright, let's go give them back to the mommy. Here you go. Yay! Really? It's not a human. It's a TV ghost. Of course, that's not the whole thing. Wow, what is this? Use the gutters to move the balls to locations that match their color. Rotate rounded edges to make each ball travel along the required route. If the ball hits a dead end, it will continue moving in the opposite direction. Okay. I don't get it. Oh, okay. Nope. Thank you for freeing me from this horrible place. I'll never forget what you've done for me. I promise I will make it up to you. Now we have a TV ghost friend, apparently. And that's the end! What? No, wait, 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 wait. The, the cop called us in because he found something and he wanted us to help him check it out. And then we did, he didn't tell us what it was. And we just ended up wandering around until we found a door we hadn't seen before. And it was a weird zoo. And we opened all the doors, and we turned the baby birds, and we let the TV ghost go, and that's the whole episode. That doesn't make any sense! Also, we already watched the credits, so we can be done with that. Alright, let me see what this room is. Secret room. Okay. No, I think I'm good. Thanks. So, that was... Uh, well, okay. Uh, I think, I think, I think we're good. I think we're good. Yes. I'm sure I want to quit. I, I don't know that, I think that was the shortest one. We did get the baby birds back to the mommy and we saved the leatherback sea turtle and we scared the puma. I guess that was good. <laughs> and now I guess the police can figure out how to get all the giant endangered animal <laughs> animals down the side of the mountain. The, the woodpecker might, might be like something that normally lives in that type of mountain range. None of those other animals are, except maybe the puma. The puma might also be, but there were gorillas and lemurs and a whale shark and a turtle. I don't know about the magpie. I don't know if magpies live in the mountains. I don't think they do. And that was it. And now I guess we have a life debt owed to us by a TV ghost. So I bet they're going to show up in the next game. And that's all kinds of interesting, isn't it? <laughs> Oh my gosh. Let's see here. I'm gonna do something real quick. Uh, and I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. okay. So the three series, aside from Mystery Case Files, which is its own thing, the three series of games, Mystery Trackers, Haunted Hotel, and Grim Tales, are connected to each other. And then after they're done, or maybe as they continue, they mold together and become detectives united james is crazy and yeah i think it was just the ghosts in the last game were jerks i agree i mean i think probably the best way is to play them in the order released which means that the haunted hotel series is now going to be put on hold because we are way farther ahead in Haunted Hotel than we are in the other two series, in Mystery Trackers and Grim Tales. So, 
instead of having the four games in rotation, including Mystery Case Files. We're going to leave off Haunted Hotel and catch up with Mystery Trackers and Grim Tales. And then we'll go back to doing the three of them in an order. In case anyone cares but me. <laughs> oh my goodness. And I, I would assume, I know you do, I would assume that we are going to get a lot more James because he is in the crossover series too. So I think he's now the official main character of Haunted Hotel. Sorry, I warned you. I mean, I might turn out to be wrong, but I'm pretty sure. So. <laughs> and since we did this one this week, next time I stream, we will do Mystery Case Files. And we are still on the second one. I think we might be able to finish it up next time, but we might need another one. It's hard to tell with those older games. They're so much harder than I thought they were. Or remembered they were, rather. I knew they were hard. I just didn't think they were that hard. And I guess that's it for the moment. Yeah, especially, you know what? It's it's worse because the screens are so tiny. If the screens weren't so tiny, they wouldn't be so bad. Because they couldn't have been that hard back when we played them originally. Yeah, so I'm, I'm hoping that the third game, Ravenhurst, has a bigger screen size. I'm not positive it will, but I'm hoping. And it will eventually get to normal size because they do go on for a while. And I guess that's it for it. It for it. It for now. That's it for now. Right. Well, I am Fate Touched, and I will see you later. Bye.